Hi, and welcome to the Dios Rodriguez Show. I'm here with special guest, Jesus Jesus. And today, I'm going to be going over El Dia de los Muertos. So let's get right into it. The first word is El Pan de Muertos. That means the, the bread of the dead. The dead. How crazy is that? Give me some nuts on that one. Woo woo. Woo 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 woo. Second word, Jesus, hit it for me. La Dulce is the candy. Um, the candy um, um, is used. Um, what is it? What, what is it represent? Can you take this one? Yeah. Los Dulces are candy. No, what, what? It's, <laughs> it's things that people use to celebrate this beautiful holiday. Amen. And they eat those Amen. candies in celebration. Amen. Whoop, whoop. Wait, 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 whoa. Okay, third word, La Cruz, which means cross. Yeah, boop, boop. They sometimes use it to represent Christianity <laughs> and the holiday. And it just gets us so happy because we love Christianity. Jesus, amen. What's the next word, man? Just go. El Angelito, which means the little angel. The little angel? What is the little angel? It's something that looks over those dead people. Yeah, 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 yeah. It looks over them so they don't go bad in heaven or boop, 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 boop. even worse down under. Yeah, man. So and the next one's La Calavera, which is skull. You know, like the skulls represent their face. Speaking of skulls, Dios, the El La Calavera de Azucar, she's a sugar skull. That and top. The sugar skull. Looks like a skull! I don't like sugar skulls. Oh. We have El Dost in November, eh? Which is the, the second of November! Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what, Dios? I'll take this. The second of November, they celebrate El Dia de los Muertos. You know what El Dia de los Muertos is? Tell them, Dios. It's the day of the day! <laughs> and so, at the day of the day, they almost everybody's wearing masks. And that in Spanish is La Mascara. And those things represent expressions of the dead people. They're dead. They're dead. <laughs> Extra cringe. La Calavera de Azucar is a sugar skull. And they just they decorate them like they would the masks. They what? Yeah. What? Yep. I'm We're doing, can you close the door or something? Okay, Kablamo. <laughs> I want to back okay, get you all night. La Calavera. Boom, 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 boom. The, the Darcy card is a sugar skull and they just decorate them. For no good reason at all. So, after that note, La Tumba. Or La Tumba! Is a tomb. What's the tomb deals? Uh, the tomb is where they bury the dead people. Whoa, dead, whoa, dead, whoa, dead whoa. people. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. And they hey. usually say their age, the day they were born, <laughs> all that good stuff. <laughs> yeah. On that note. El Papel Picado is confetti. And they use confetti at their Fiestas, which is means party. They make it rain that confetti. Woo woo! What's about mariposa? Mariposa is a butterfly. It's a very symbolic animal. It's beautiful. It's, it's alive and stuff, but the dead people aren't. <laughs> They're all dead. I am not a kid. On that note. Police means very happy. Oh. Uh, that's it for today's episode of uh, the Diaz Rodriguez show. But like, is it though? We still have to talk about El Cemeterio. You know what? You're right. It's a cemetery where they bury dead people. Okay, bye. Bye.